Culture Days may be this weekend, but last weekend, a significant teaser event was put on behind the museum. Right at the same time, the farmer's market was on, so there was, yes, a built-in audience, but still a lot of people stood around and checked things out. Culture Days, a little bit different in 2020, but still it's great to see people out and about in person. It's a great way to get started, is to come here and explain that we've got a month-long list of activities, and they're online and live. So we'll be back again at 12 o'clock on Saturday. Well, I'm new to North Bay, and so uh, when I come to an event like this, I feel like I can be part of something and uh, get to know other people who are new. And I think uh, when people who are from North Bay see this, they like to see that their community is growing and there are new things to do and people to meet that are doing new things. You know, there's people who've been speaking Spanish to me today and French and English. And I know next week we'll have the Filipino community here and uh, we'll have some puppets and a parade and it really is welcoming. Justine Gagoa is well singer, dancer, performer, and in this case, choreographer. And in this case, she wants to use Culture Days as a way to inspire everyone. Always have to think when you're down, maybe your neighbor is deep down. So if you still have a little bit of strength and creativity that can heal not just you, but also positively affect your neighbor, go for it. You can't go wrong with drum. Music heals. We grow up with drum. As you can see, uh, Giselle is on the stage. Try many instruments. When we're deep down in Africa, when there is a death, there is a pain, bring the drum. And then we do dancing like a jingo to bring the stress out of our system. So instrument, especially percussions, just take away attention. It's really crucial to have a little instrument. You don't have to be a good musician. Just go on the drum and then put all your anger on it. 